stay here many years ago. Oh, really? um, uh, this used to be a hotel. Oh, really? Yes. Many years ago. Was it st did it still have the same name? Uh, yes, hotel? yes it did. What's the name of the building again? The Dixboroughs. And another famous building that's still up is the St. Moritz Hotel. I wish I could find that. He did a good John Wayne on my show. Gillespie was reluctant to bring along the often unreliable Parker. Yeah, my mother used to uh, play it back in that King Cole as a horn player. David, where are you from? Chicago. Yeah. I grew up in the Midwest, uh, and then I had, I lived in New York. I lived in Washington, D.C. for a while. What year did you move to Los Angeles? I moved to Los Angeles when I got maybe in 1976. Mm -hmm. What brought you out to L.A.? Well, I wanted to become a big star, uh -huh. comedian, stand-up comedian, musician. I used to be uh, good friends with uh, for, um, Freddie Prince and also uh, uh, Robin Williams. And then I used to work at a comedy store with him. I started the comedy store in the Ice House and worked as a stand-up comedian. Mm -hmm. And then I went to L.A. City College for theater and acting. And you said you were in the Navy, right? Yeah. How many years were you in the Navy? Uh, three. Yeah. But I think you said you were discharged, right? Yeah. What happened? I don't like the yeah, okay. uh, Christian science, you know, they don't believe in doctors and medical discharge. Okay. So um, I'm now into UFOs. Uh, I'd like you to play one of my UFO programs, or you or you would like to see the show that that Mr. Squ uh, uh, what should we call him did of John Wayne. Tar and. Hey, well. Yeah. Uh, uh, David, tell you about this stuff. I'm, um, so, uh, wait, 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 one second. Uh, I air my shows in Washington D.C. and they only air on Super VHS, and you have to pay twenty dollars for membership. And I've been airing in Washington D.C. for for five years. Mm -hmm. And uh, I lived in Washington, D.C., and that's where, uh, where uh, Jim Henson was my Sunday school teacher in the Christian Science Church. Cool. And um, so um, I, uh, you have to fill out an application with each tape, mm -hmm. the length of the tape, who's on the tape. And uh, these are going to uh, Washington, D.C. How many do you send usually? Well, I'm sending them eight shows. You know, to dub these, uh, VDI charged me. Two hundred and two dollars to dub these. It took me two months to pay for them. Wow. It's expensive. And David, David with, with doing a public access show as being as expensive it is, as it is, why do you keep doing it? Well, to help the kids out. I mm -hmm. come from a family of school teachers. Before they were school teachers, my family mm -hmm. were Lutheran and Quaker ministers mm -hmm. from Pennsylvania and Presbyterian ministers. Uh, uh, you, and uh, to help the kids out, our kids need directions and need help and guidance. And uh, what do you, tell me more about the kids. What do you think about the youth today? In well, the youth need discipline, and they need. Uh, they I feel they should go in the in the military so they can learn uh, morals and ethics and discipline. And they need to be disciplined, disciplined, and learn to have to have their life in order, because the kids are so disrespectful to the elders and the parents and the school teachers. Do you what? think kids have gotten worse over time? They've gotten worse. Yeah. When I grew up in the 50s, we wouldn't dare do the stuff that the kids do today. Uh, I'm 45. I was born in the 50s. It was very strict back then. Mm -hmm. Were your parents strict? Yeah. My mother was in, was in the military, too, and, and she was very strict. She was stricter than my dad. Were they religious? Or? Yeah, they were. They were my parents were. My, 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 my family uh, on my mother's side was originally Catholic, and then, they, then my mother's uh, was was uh, switched over to African Methodist, and then she was a Unity minister, and then she became a Christian Scientist. And then on my dad's side, they were uh, Catholic, Lutheran, Presbyterian, and Quaker, and Christian, then Christian Science. What wow. were you raised? I was raised in a Christian Science Church. Yeah. Uh, anyway, I want to play Francine Dancer for you. I'm gonna get a shot from back here, but if you can. Stay up here with the boom. You want to videotape Francine Dancer? Yeah. After this, the Francine Dancer will talk about UFOs. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
I forgot to bring my keyboard, my cassette tape. So I had to do the show at the Pella. spacecraft and abducted 